Hi, my name is Ashish and in this video we will see how to create AWS LightSail, LightSail instance with Windows Server. So let me just log on to the AWS LightSail portal and take it from there. I am logged on to the AWS LightSail portal and if you're not sure how you're going to do it, so AWS LightSail portal login. If you will click on here on the first option, if you would see get started with light sale for free, probably it will take you to the console. Okay, you have to log in with your existing account, your Amazon account with which you log on to your AWS console. You have to log in with the same account and you would be redirected to the light sale portal. Absolutely. It says you have no instance right now. Create an instant instance and get started with LightSail. Click on create instance. Instance location, change AWS region and availability zone. I'm not sure I'm going to do that. You want to do in Mumbai. Let's select Mumbai. You are creating an instance in zone A. They say you select a platform. Let's go for Windows. I'm going to go for Windows Server 2016. You can add a PowerShell script that runs on, on your instance the first time it launches. If you would click on and if you have any PowerShell script that you want to add as a launch script, you can add it here. Check out our new 16 GB and 632 GB RAM bundles. So if you want to filter it from the memory side, processing side, storage side, and the transfer acceleration side, and I just want to sort it by price per month. And it says first month, it is free. I'm going to select it and the minimum is $8. And it says you can try the selected plan free for one month up to 750 hours. Absolutely, I will do it. Plans in Mumbai include lower data transfer allowance other than, than other regions. You can read about it more if you have to. Identify your instance. I am making Windows Server 2016 one one instance you want to use tax to filter and organize resource in the light sale console you can do it i'm going to click on create instance stuck on it has stopped on pending create instance it is the another instance that has gone so it is pending as of now and it will be done as soon Pending. Let's wait when it comes up. See, my instance is running, and if you will click on it, it has five, 500 MB of RAM, it has one CPU, 30 GB storage. If you will click on it, you can connect, you can still use your own compatible RDB client with your device or software to connect to the instance default login. Credentials are these. Show the default password. Copy it. It is for this instance only. Username is administrator. Then you can connect it to. You can stop it. You can reboot it from here. So if I can to the RDP, this is the public IP. 15206172193. So pull up your RDB client. So if it is 15.206.172.193, connect. I'm getting connected to my light sale instance. It is setting up my personalized data. It'll take a few minutes, a few seconds to warm up and load because it is having the low configuration. Here you are. Logged on to the 
light sail instance and you can have use it as per your needs install it install other applications on it so we'll see what more we can do with the light sail instances in the coming videos if you have any queries please mention them in the comment section and if you have any suggestions please also those are also welcome and i'll see you guys in the next video thank you bye bye